Dad Stop the Burning I Beg You, horrifying footage reveals badly burned Kurdish children in Syria amid claims Turkey is using banned weapons such as napalm and white phosphorus. Here's a summary of the article. Horrifying images have emerged showing badly burned children in Syria, amid claims that Turkey is using banned chemical weapons against the Kurds. Distressing footage taken at a hospital in Tal Tamr, near the border city of Ras al Ain, which has seen the heaviest fighting, on Monday shows a boy with deep burns to his entire upper body. Hamish de Breton Gordon, a British chemical weapons expert, said the burns appeared consistent with white phosphorus, a banned chemical weapon which sticks to the skin and burns in contact with moisture, meaning it cannot be put out. Dr. Fares Hamu, speaking to Kurdish outlets on Wednesday, said the burns appeared consistent with the use of banned chemical weapons such as napalm. Under the terms of the deal Turkey will halt its assault on northern Syria for five days while Kurdish forces withdraw from a 20-mile-wide safe zone President Erdogan wants to create along the border. Despite an outcry among both Democratic and Republican lawmakers over the pullout and the Turkish invasion, Trump insisted a fight between Turkey and the Kurds was not a U.S. problem and that things are very nicely under control in northern Syria. Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov said in remarks carried by Russian news agencies that Moscow is committed to mediating between Syria and Turkey. This post received a score of 82,297, with an upvote ratio of 85%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Why is it always the poor innocents? Hell is hell and war is war. Of the two, war is worse. There are no innocent bystanders in hell. Except for the brass, everyone involved in war is an innocent bystander. Mash. Shout out to war profiteers, we couldn't do it without them. Similar props to police, a vital ingredient of any police state. Big ups to corrupt politicians, greasing the cogs of progress. Corruption and politician are the same thing. This is heartbreaking. It's even more heartbreaking when you realize it was completely preventable. Just devastating. Seriously, there's no reason for this. Turkey wouldn't have had the balls to do shit if Trump didn't order the withdrawal. America's foreign policy has always been considered calculating, but this man's regime is making us realize that instead it is in equal parts comprised of stupidity and greed. Pathetic. Greater than Turkey wouldn't have had the balls to do shit if Trump didn't order the withdrawal. And Trump wouldn't have had the balls to order the withdrawal if Mitch McConnell and the Senate didn't constantly collaborate with his cover-ups and enable him. Even they were against this one. Absolutely no one supported this, and he knew that when he did it, which makes me think someone is forcing his hand on it. Edit, I'll also just point out how hard the Trump spin crew is working in these comments. Like, curiously hard. It's a nightmare of media lies and, yeah but when Obama, down there. Interesting to see such a push like that on this matter. A matter that strongly concerns Russia. Greater than even they were against this one. Absolutely no one supported this. If they were so against it, what are they going to do about it? My money is on, continue to support and protect him. I think we've gotten some, very concerned, comments, but I don't think we've hit, furrowed brows, quite yet. Still a long ways off from them actually taking real action. McCain made it too disturbing before he passed so I'm not optimistic. Sometimes you have to let them fight a little while. Sometimes you have to let them fight like two kids. Fuck you, Donald J. Trump. Tough. Love. I bet Don J.R. has never been in a fair fight in his whole miserable life. The man is a monster. Welp, if we hadn't just created a new generation of terrorists in that area before, we sure as fuck have now. Blowback from shitty foreign policy. That's what led to 9-11 and a lot of our enemies targeting us. No 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 we can do no wrong, therefore, there can never be blowback. It's impossible. Simply impossible. No, what's really going on here is that they hate our freedoms. S. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.